What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Mike Rich, man. What's happening with y'all? I hope everybody is having a blessed day today. Today, I'm at Lenox Mall. Going to Lenox during the week is a whole lot better than going to Lenox on the weekend on Saturdays. If you're not familiar with Lenox Mall, it's like the most popular mall in Atlanta for some reason. I guess it's because it's in the heart of Buckhead, which is one of the richer cities in Atlanta. And that's why all the uh, uh, celebrities and stuff, uh, they, they visit Lenox when they come to Atlanta, man. But going on Saturday, I hate going to Lenox on Saturday because the traffic is stupid. It takes forever just to get in the parking lot and then you got to like park in the parking deck or something. But I'm actually in the actual parking lot in front of the mall right now. There's Macy's. I don't know if y'all can see that. But anyway, um, I got a, I'm going to see the Avengers Infinity War movie with my wife tonight. And I left work early, but I'm like, I'm like almost two and a half hours too early for the movie. It's at Phelps Plaza, which is like a, right across the street. So I thought I'd go in at Lenox and check out a couple of pair of whatever they got in here hopefully i see and i doubt i'm gonna see them so i don't even know why i'm hoping but the patchwork um all red air max 97s that came out i hope if nike got them i'm copping them it's a dope shoe i kind of slept on the release um and then it might be a couple it might be a couple other releases in in there that i'll check out but anyway Let's go ahead and check out some Linux action. I need some jeans, too. I, I know people say, Mike, Rich, you always buying pants. That's because half of the pants I buy, I don't like the way they fit, so I have to go and buy other pants. Anyway, let's go ahead and see what I got on. Of course, I got on the Black Panther shirt, comic book, old school action. Um, no cuts, no edits. Hold up, man. I'm so close to this car next to me. Uh, um, got on these distressed khakis. And then I got on my Laney five things tongue covered up tongue kind of fat on these so i kind of like keep them on the tuck on these guy 23 on the side Woo, ladies shout out my guy c who um gave me these in a that yeezy trade yes sir anyway yeah the blue tint yeezys i uh plus cash he gave me um for these sneakers right here i mean for the yeezys i thought it was a dope trade since i don't like yeezys at all <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, man, uh, Linux Mall. Let's see what they got in here. I won't go in Gucci because I don't really care about Gucci. I won't go in none of the high dollar spots, Fendi, Bagari, places like that. I don't really go in them unless, you know what I'm saying? Not especially not when I'm just going to the mall just to uh, basically waste time. But I will buy some shoes, though. I spent $200, but I'm not finna spend $2,500. <laughs> not today. Anyway, man, they're going to the mall. First stop is gonna be Nike. You already know. Let's do it. You gotta walk up. You gotta walk up a couple of flights of steps just to get to the top of Nike. Up there with a where the kicks at, man. They want you to get they want you to get fit when you when you first get here. They want you to get your exercise in when you get here, I guess. But here we are. Nike. Linux Mall. I guess we're gonna start by the Jordans. So it looked like I see a restock already. It must have did a restock of the um, blue guys. The uh, what's the name of these? I forgot the name. <laughs> I forgot the name of the shoe. I got the shoe. Reverse Shadow Bat Boy? No. <laughs> Royal Game Royal. Okay, Game Royal Jordan ones. How could I forget? How could I forget? But then they got, you know, shadows. So slept on, so dope. Then they got the um, humbacks. I catch these on sale later on if I can, but they're not sitting a lot of places like that, like I thought they would. They're starting to sell a little bit. But they do got the Game Royal guys. Um, I don't know if it's a restock or not. This is actually a size 12, my size, but I already got them, so put those back. And they got these, uh, Converse leather leather feel pretty nice on these. Um, I forgot what it was. I forgot the meaning of this kind. It says 1980. I forgot what these are supposed to be. It just says pro leather. They're a hundred dollars, which is I guess is not a bad price. I'm just not a big fan of this Dr. J kind of silhouette um, of the Converse. Never really been a fan of the Dr. J joints. But when you really think about it. I don't know, it's kind of the same shape as the Jordan 1s. Not really. <laughs> Not really. 
So here's an Air, Air Max 97s right here. And I guess they didn't get the uh, red ones because I don't see them. Just because I don't see them don't mean they didn't get them. It just means that they did, either they didn't get them or they gone already. I mean, I don't see them. <laughs> That's all that means. Well, they going, where were they going with that colorway? Like they was like, let's go with the black, red, and white. And then at the bottom, they was like, wait a minute. Let's add some bow. <laughs> Here's another shoe that I just can't make myself like. I don't care how much I look at this shoe. Just like the Air Max 270s, man. I don't care how much I look at this shoe. I, I just don't like it. The Vapor Max bottom on top of a classic Air Max is just, it just don't do it for me, man. That, that don't look good. It just don't look good. That bad stumper is too. A couple of Air Max, Air Maxes, got them Pippins. I know a lot of people looking forward to the red one, the red colorway that's coming out like that, the OG one. Um, I have to see it in hand. It's mostly leather though. It's not new buck like that one right there. You got your, um, got your phones, a couple pair of phones. This the, is the one with the swoosh come off. Yeah, that's the one with the swoosh comes off of it. Um, you got these, um, what's his name? Uh, Rasheed Wallace. You got the Rasheed Wallace um, joints right here, 2004. I guess it's kind of like the same pack or those Converse or Dr. J's. It's the, is it a 16 pack? I don't I don't know. That's a 16 and a, I guess that's what it is. But um, they can have these as well. It's just Air Force One highs. Never really, you know, maybe in high school, but you know, not recently. But they got these and they 130. And then you got all your basketball kicks, nothing really new, nothing really special. Um, wouldn't it be dope if they actually had this LeBron in here? Or, see, those ain't came out yet. Or if they had the ones, which I'm not even a big fan of those ones either. They're just so chrome looking. I don't, I don't know. But they do have the Kobe's, the, uh, uh, what's the name? I just said his name. You know what I'm talking about. And then the, these right here. Let me see these Kobe's, man. This is a big shoe. It must just be the only one they got left or something. But um, I'm not really a big fan of the Kobe ones either, man. They super, super clunky, bro. Like these joints are just thick, man. I know it's some clunky shoes that I like, but these, this is not one of them right here. I don't know, this joint, this joint just, this thing look heavy, boy. Plus, you know, the Lakers colorway, I ain't really a big fan of the purple and yellow. So let me put them down and stop talking about how much I don't like this shoe. <laughs> but they are 175, by the way. Let me see what size this is. And wouldn't you know it, it's my size. It's a size 12. Um, but they finna stay on the shelves today. I let somebody else come and get the guy. Yeah, man. So she said they did get the um, the patchwork Air Max 97 uh, all red guys, but she said that they sold out. So, oh well. Too bad for that. Here's the Kobe's again. They must have got a bunch of these Kobe's. And they got them on the mannequin. They got them posed. Did they just come out today or something? Like, did I miss something? Might have just came out today. I don't know. The young guys that y'all saw behind me a second ago, I think they was calling my name while I was recording. I wasn't being a mean. I wasn't being an asshole to them. I, I talked to them after, after I put a break in the recording. I just wanted to finish talking about those Kobe's first. Shout out to you two guys. They asked me what outlet I go to. And I sent them down there to get some heat, you feel me? So, uh, the rest, now it's time for the rest of them all. They said, those guys told me that uh, City Gear, I think they said City Gear has Shadow Ones left. It's crazy how these shoes keep popping up because I saw them at my mall too. And they're not reselling for a lot, so, like, if you want that shoe, you can get it, you know what I'm saying? I just want to go in, down here and see if they actually got them and I want to look at the pairs to see if they got some buttery pairs. I mean, I got two pairs already, so I definitely won't be buying another one. But I just want to see if they got some buttery looking Air Jordan 1 OG High shadow things. Let's see. They do have the Air Max 1 watermelon is what they call in these, which I never had watermelon that was pink. It's kind of more reddish and then the green is not this color either, <laughs> but gotta have a nickname, I guess. Uh, $110. Uh, I got my Air Max 98 South Beaches, man, so I think I'm cool on these. But uh, y'all come below and tell me what y'all think of these things right here. Tell me.
Let me know. Let me know. Let me know. I like when they they do the 93 Air Max logo on the back of 91. I mean, uh, Air Max ones. I don't like this colorway, but I like when they do that. The snow beach joints I got are made in that way. So this is uh, for the people who say I never show grade school. Some grade school for y'all. Got some glittery chromium look, <laughs> looking threes right there. Got some OG guys. Black cement still in the GS sizes. Go all, all the way up to a size seven. So get you some. Got some O threes right here. I hate the midsole on these GS threes. They're not doing y'all no justice with that midsole. I like this colorway right here. Jordan 6 low. Um, they got the sales in GS for 99. Quality is just as good, if, if not a little bit better. These things are mad wrinkly, bro. Um, and this, I guess this is a little bit bigger size. Yeah, they still gave the GS pretty decent quality on those. Gatorade joints. 13s. Shadow guys. GS stuff is... It goes on sale a whole lot quicker than um than the men's shadows. They actually got look at that. They actually got shadows in this guy. Like, they got, they look like they got, a, well, look, they laced though. So, what am I supposed to think about that? Did they get a restock? Or what? Like, these pairs are not, that pair, this pair is not that great right here. This is a 10 and a half. See, this is a 12 right here, and they got better quality. Look, it got better quality than that 10 and a half I just looked at. They just show you how inconsistent they are in the pairs, man. But I keep finding shadows, man. I just keep running in the shadow ones, bro. They're everywhere. Yeah, so they said the Air Max, I mean the um, the shadow ones came from a store that didn't sell out. So they, they sent them to the stores that they thought they would sell in. That's what happened with that. These are those, um, what are they called? Flyknit something. These were hyped up at one point, I remember. I never really been a big fan. They look comfortable, but I didn't get the hype. I would wear this shoe, but I never really got the hype. How much is it? It's 150. I went I wouldn't pay 150 for that shoe. In my opinion, this shoe is an outlet pickup. That's just my opinion though. And they, and they got a full size run of those too. Wait a minute. Did I miss something? Why is this in here? <laughs> Did I miss something? I like these. But now I'm, I always say, well, I can't get them, so I ain't gonna worry about it. Now they're right in front of me and I can get them. But do I want them? I'd rather have the Moab joints, but beggars can't be choosers because this is like, not like it's a shoe that's just, I don't know, it's the Air Max 95 version of the LeBron 15, so. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what to do right now. I'm standing here stuck. They won, what are they? They $200. Okay, that made the decision. I'm good. <laughs> Gum bottom colorway in these? I guess. Okay, then. Man, shout out to uh, Greg at the Sneak This Podcast. He was talking about these guys right here, I think. Yeah, the blow, um, Mind Blower or whatever. Feliz that came out back in the day. Retail $80. They actually not that bad. I'm from Atlanta, man, so you know uh, Feli, man. We, we we used to be only Feli back in the day. This shoe is actually not that bad. This is the black, the white, black, and red version. And Feli's making a comeback, too, even though everybody ain't wearing the shoes. People are, like, rocking the gear or whatever. And this is the white and blue uh, colorway of them right here. Damn, I thought, <laughs> thought that was somebody standing right there, boy. Watch out, nigga. Uh, <laughs> yeah, but, uh... They need to work on a paint job, though, man. Look at that. Look at that. Come on, Fila. If you're trying to make a comeback, you're going to have to get some better painting skills going on. I actually really kind of like this black, <laughs> this, this one right here. I don't know, man. 
It's kind of dad shoe-ish, but you know, dad shoes making a comeback, I guess. These are really dad shoes right here. These are some clumpers. These are some clump, clump, ant bed demolishers right here, boy. Damn them thick. So what is these Ultra Boots right here? Is this like the 4.0 or something? I don't know, do it say it? These are $200 too. Ultra Boost Climb. Climb? What, what does that mean? It's just regular Ultra Boost. And they look different. They got like these little perforations in them and stuff. But why are they $200, bro? Like that's the 3.0 I believe and that's 180. And for some reason this one is 200. Oh, 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 okay then. The boost you wear. I think Adidas thought this shoe right here was gonna kind of like blow up, but didn't really happen. The sole of these, the like the sole looks like them desert rat Kanye's uh, a little bit, or mud ducks or whatever they call them, them things. The only thing I really saw that was worth getting in there was shadows in the whole mall, like shadow ones. Since I already got two pair, uh, I can't mess with them. And I also saw <clears throat> them LeBrons. City Gear said they only sent them one pair. It's like a size eight. That was the only one that they sent them. I thought that was weird. They said they was testing the shoe out or something like that. And they were trying to get me to buy it. I was like, I don't wear a size eight, number one plus. I would rather have the Griffey. They got the Griffey colorway. I would be on them. She said, well, everybody gonna want that one. I was like, okay, but I'm not finna see him buy a size eight <laughs> in a shoe that I can't wear. Anyway, that's pretty much it in this mall, man. I've wasted enough time. Ready to go see Avengers Infinity War and do the cleanse review and put that up on my movie channel. If you haven't already subscribed to my movie channel, go down there in the comments, I mean in the uh, description box. Click on that link, check out my movie channel. Uh, Avengers Infinity War should be up um, in the next couple of days, man. We're going to like this event down there at Phil's Plaza. They're going to give us all this like commemorative uh, souvenirs for the movie and stuff like that. So it should be dope. Man, so I didn't um, end up getting anything today. I, like I said, I saw a couple of things that was dope. I just didn't, just nothing that I really wanted that I didn't already own. You feel me? Uh, gray 11 lows coming out. Cool gray things coming out Saturday. Uh, y'all comment below if y'all going after those. I actually like the shoe. It's crazy because I said I wasn't really feeling the cool grays and I, I'd never been a fan of the mids. I never been a fan of cool gray nines. But for some reason on these pictures of them seeing that these cool gray 11 lows, they looking kind of fire. I ain't even gonna lie. I like I just like the way the blue ice is hitting off the white and the gray. They look kind of dope and the white laces. And then I like the fact that the um, it's suede at the top. They looking kind of nice to me. I ain't gonna lie. I don't know if I'm going after them or not. If I see them sitting and I get to look at them in hand, I might cop. But I didn't do no reservations or nothing like that. So we'll see how Saturday goes. But anyway, uh, that's been my little quick Linux vlog. Y'all comment below if y'all saw something in this video that you liked or that you want to speak on. You might be copying. Um, that's it, man. Hit the thumbs up button. Hit the subscribe, guy. Hit the notification bell so you can be a part of Rich Nation. Stand all the way up through the sunroof to the clouds. Been raining a little bit today. And keep watching my video, because that's what I'm here for. Gone.